welcome ladies and gentlemen thank you so much for your always great support morara kebaso beaten badly by other unknown odm goons at bombers and let's watch this video They were in a public participation uh, signatory, signatory on regarding Gashagwa's impeachment. So I don't know why these people decided to beat that uh, the young gentleman, yet he have not committed any sin. He have not even abused, he have not even insulted anyone. So I wonder why they have decided, were these people hired, first of all, or what really happened here? The leak details have not been revealed to us as Kenyans also are still wondering and asking themselves several questions why this have happened to Morara Kibasu. Anyway, I want us to dig deep into this. What normally happens here? It is this way. When, uh, when uh, the government have seen there's someone speaking the truth. There's someone exposing them. The government must try by any means to ensure that they distract this person. There's no way you can convince me that Morara was just sitting at a place peacefully. Or is it because the other day he said that if it is a matter of impeachment, that led all of them to be impeached? William Ruto and uh, Rigadi Gashagwa. It is not all about William Ruto. So I think these people had that fear that Morara was going to create chaos. And the best option is to beat him or to beat him or they had another plan. That is what had happened there. But it is very wrong. Under which article are we allowed to do this? Under which article? You can as well tell me. These are the factors which always hinders us from behind in development. They always, it's, it always hinders us behind from development. Because each and every person have that stupidity. Most of today, if you go to Nyanza, Nyanza people are, are, are having this mediocracy that they only they must only defend depend on ODM party alone. They must only depend on ODM party alone. Even if Atakama Finuliwa, Nazima wakai tu kwa ODM. ODM akuna kitu mefanya nyanza mu imu. Imi nasema mkipenda mu mkuje munishike bas. Imefanya nini mu imu. Most leaders who have uh, been uh, selected with ODM party, if you go to Nyanza, I've, no, I've done nothing. The same way to other places. So it is all about political interest. Today they are sending goons to attack Morara Kibasu because Morara always speaks the truth. Morara always injects the government. Kama ume ukonania ama chuki na mutu, kwa nini unataka kumpiga? Why don't you just set another political party and fight with them in politics? Kuliko kupigea, kupiga mutu for nothing. Morala also is a Kenyan. He have that right to participate in public participation. The same way you, you the person who was sent to create chaos on the, in this public participation. That is how you misbehave until you make this country turn into chaos because of that fight. I want to say this. Kenyans who are watching me outside there, please stop being misused by any politician in this country. Fight for your own benefit. Fight for your own sons and daughters. Tomorrow you never know. Things might change. The person you are fighting for will only have interest to be popular to be popular 
but I have no business with you. Use and dump. And that is what people are today in this world. Today you are beating Morara Kebasu for no reason. You are making him to be popular and he is becoming strong again. But it's not okay or not good to fight young politician, young leader like Morara Kebasu. Leaders are being born. We have leaders in this country who are fake. They never have that art of helping millions of Kenyans. Morana Kebasu have exposed several things in government, which is true. To the governors, to the MCS, they are reluctant and they no longer having time to fulfill their promises. I told you just the other day in this phone, I made a call to, I had struggled to call my MP, area MP. He ran away and I asked him a simple question. Even up to date, I'm still asking him. Why are other places having no electricity? yet other places are having he told me that it's not his work imagine a leader talking that way then i asked myself what is the role of a leader and that is why we are failing as kenya to the odm goons we are fond of and we are aware of this character even today if i have chance to to get to to have my party i better form my own political party not joining odm this is the useless party I ever ever seen before. It's a party loves itself, a party with no even firmness, a party with political conmanship, a very bad party, hiring goons for nothing. They don't want to speak the truth. I don't know if they were used by William Ruto's party to beat someone for no reason. It's very wrong. Let us change our character as Kenyans. Let us avoid being misused. For how long will we stand alone and leave leaders to fight themselves? Na nani amekwambia ati we hautakufa? Nani amekwambia? Ulisoma Biblia ati kuna mtu atabaki kwa hii dunia. Dunia kila mtu ataenda. Uwe handsome, uwe beautiful, uwe powerful. Kila mtu Mawe tu ndiyo itabaki na mawe pia Biblia inasema itageuzwa. Mawe itageuzwa kwa ma, uh, kwa mpango ya Mungu. Wewe si Mungu lakini hata kama sisi tu Mungu si Mungu. Yes we are not God. But we have been given that privilege to rule and control the earth. Through God's power we have been managed to become politicians. Why don't we use this opportunity to help other people also to enjoy the leadership we've been given by God and the people? Because if we keep on fighting, then we are the ones ruling our country. We are the ones fighting among ourselves. We have nothing to, to gain but just to lose. If you keep abduction, if you keep on abducting people, arresting people, threatening people, those are nonsense. These are just things of the world. Yes, that is it. Please let us fight for this, our country. Not fighting physically, but mentally. Or now we can solve our situation, our problem. How we can take this country to the next level. Yes, William Ruta failed. Today is impeaching his, his deputy because of his total failure to escape the goat. Now, it is the best time, I know you will choose another deputy. It's the best time to come up with another agenda. How we can stabilize our country, how we can create job opportunity, how we can solve our problem. But not finding time of sending goons to beat the young generation. The young man, Morara Kibasu, at Bomas. Shame on you. Shame on you. That is what I truly used to say, always say. It's very bad, eh? Tafadhali tubadilishani. Tuwacheni na siyasa ya chuki. Siyasa usiweke kwa roo. Siyasa usiweke kwa roo. Sao? Usiweke kwa roo. It's very bad and so sad. Thank you. And kindly subscribe to this YouTube channel if you never subscribe. Like my video, watch, share, and give us your opinion. Bye bye.